Hey everyone, so with Easter approaching and with me needing eggs for dinner, for a salad, today I'm going to show you how to make the perfect boiled eggs. So a couple of things, first of all you have to use eggs that are old, if you, if you raise your own chickens, if you're lucky enough to raise your own chickens, um, you may have fresh eggs, but if you buy them from the store like me, then you don't have to worry about it. Um, eggs that are older are much easier to peel afterwards. And another tip is if you're going to be using your eggs for like devil's eggs or something like that, and you need the yolk to be centered right in the middle of the egg, and they've been sitting for a while, make sure to turn them over for about 10 minutes so the yolk then starts to settle on the other side and it gets right in the middle. But this is only if you're going to be doing an open egg presentation. <laughs> All right, so I have the eggs flipped and this is how you boil them. Another tip. So since I'm going to be boiling just four eggs for salad for dinner, I am using a small pan, so let's say if you're going to be boiling four eggs, don't use something way bigger than that so the eggs are not just bouncing all over the place. So I'm going to place the eggs right in here, as such, and then I'm going to add some water, cold water. So I added the cold water and now I'm going to turn the burner on high, I'm going to close them and I'm going to keep a close eye on them and wait for the water to start to boil. But cold eggs out of the refrigerator with cold water. So the eggs just started to boil, now I'm going to turn them off and just let them sit in the burner for 12 minutes. Don't open them, don't remove them from the burner, just set the timer for 12 minutes. And after 12 minutes just run the eggs under cold water until the water is cool enough that you can touch it. Dump some of the hot water out. Be careful, of course, as always. All right, dump the water out and just let the egg sit until you're comfortable touching them so you can peel them or until you're ready to use them. All right, so let's see how well I did. First of all, let's see how easy it is to peel them. It should be pretty easy, so you can see, pretty darn easy. There you go, very easy. Okay, let's try another one. Look at that, Ooh, that is so easy, isn't it? I'm so good at peeling eggs. So if anyone ever tells you that you're so bad at cooking that you can't even peel an egg or boil, you can't even boil an egg, you can use this video, learn how to boil an egg and shut them up. Alright, and the last one. So. I don't know if you can see on the camera, but there is a little skin between the egg, between the egg and the shell. And if you can manage to grab that, then the peeling is just easy. Easy breezy. Look at that. And now I'm gonna slice one so you can see the doneness of the egg is. Ooh, look at that. Look at that perfect egg. All right, let's slice another one. And the yolk, it's not too off-center. It's okay, I suppose. Could be better. There you go. Now you know how to boil the perfect egg. In the next video, I'm going to show you some egg coloring with uh, food, with actual food. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.